Good morning, I'm Fiona Porter from Cotswold Country Flowers and I'm just going to give you a little insight into a typical day of a small flower grower. So typically it starts pretty early with flower cutting, um, so it's just gone half past six and I've got a florist's order for this evening, so perfect time is to cut flowers early in the morning um, and condition them all day ready for the florist to pick up in the evening. Essential kit for cutting is a cutting list and your snips. On a morning like today, I must admit I couldn't think of anything better to do, but there's plenty of other jobs to be doing alongside uh, cutting flowers. Next job of the day is to pack away these dried flowers so I can make room for some more to dry in my kitchen. And I use these boxes and they get stored for um, until the autumn. Bucket washing is a weekly job. That's a lot of buckets, but all ready for tomorrow's DIY wedding flowers. So next on the to-do list is some admin. Um, and most important thing today is to get my self-guided tour booklet ready for my guests at the um, open garden on Saturday uh, to celebrate the flower farmer's big weekend. Okay, so it is 4.40. Um, I probably did about five hours of admin today got that um, garden tour sorted out so thought great come out to the garden um, tidy up what I managed to do yesterday with Anthea um, so and then it starts raining it is raining now the winds got up need to get this done and I've got not one but two barrows absolutely chock-a-block with weeds because um, all the time I'm cutting flowers and doing weddings um, it means the poor garden gets a little bit neglected so it's constant catch-up constant catch-up anyway it's still nice to be outside isn't it <laughs> 